All right, folks, this is pretty exciting stuff. As you know, uh, kids are going to be going back to school soon. Um, fortunately for us in New York, we don't go back to school till after Labor Day, so there'll be an opportunity uh, for me and the kids to... Uh, to uh, go to uh, the beach or to get a little sun and travel around, a little barnstorming at the end of the, uh, the summer. Uh, but, of course, in the back of my mind, I just uh, ordered some supplies for Saul for school and going to go out to Staples and get some black felt pens and whatever's on the list from kindergarten. And, of course, we have this opportunity from Fox Business, Mornings with Maria Bartorama where she is uh, showing us the uh, latest in backpacks for kids going to school. Welcome back. Back to school. Back taking on all new meaning this morning. MC Armor is the company behind high-end bulletproof backpacks and clothing that are revamping the protective equipment market. It is anticipated to reach more than $5 billion in the next seven years. That would be the revenue in this business. Here to tell us more about it is Carolina Ballesteros Casas, MC Armor Marketing Manager. Carolina, good to see you. Thanks so much for joining us. Good morning. Maria. And you brought a lot of things. You designed these bulletproof backpacks specifically for the United States. Yes, exactly. We have different categories of lines of product we have the gold collection black collection is fashion with ballistics and we have the backpacks for kids <laughs> why did you decide God. to bring these to the u.s. okay in the u.s. sadly there's the gun fact everybody can have a gun so here kids need to be protected and we have the fact that there is some school issues so we need to bring this to the United States tell us how it works so yeah. this is this is not it doesn't even feel like it's heavier no. than, a, than a regular backpack oh, we have great. here the okay. backpack so this plate. is what's in there exactly. this is the, what stops the bullet that's the ballistic plate <laughs> got it Thank okay God. it have to be hard not soft because kids we work with pediatricians we have a company with the research and development right and the pediatrician says kids before 15 years, they don't have fat, they don't have enough muscles, so they need to have hard ballistics. Mm. And also, oh to be wear it as a shield. God. Oh my goodness. It's incredible that this, is, that this has come to this, though, that we need bulletproof clothing. Some of these things are quite fashion forward. I mean, tell us about, for example, something like oh this, God. which I feel it in here. Oh yeah, exactly. My God. It's heavier, but this looks like. A very fashionable jacket. There you go. That's the idea. Yeah, tell yeah, us. Yeah, that's for the teacher. Okay. We were with Miguel Caballero's brand. We were I, 13 presidents in Latin America. We have prime ministers wearing this. So it's very lightweight. You can see it's wearable. It's fashionable, but wearable mm. and protection. You said you have presidents wearing this. What about mm. business people? You also do this in suits, right? Yes, exactly. And this, here is this one, which is also, I feel it in the back. You've got one of those things in the front and All in right. the back. I, I mean, I think uh, I've seen enough. Um, really fascinating about uh, children uh, that you can't have like a Kevlar vest on them because they don't have the fat and the, uh, the muscle to uh, stop the uh, bullet that is uh, necessary. They're literally they? talking about, they're like, Cesar Coveria wore this when Pablo Escobar was literally killing thousands of people in Colombia with narco-terrorism. And now your child can also wear it because right. we won't do the absolute bare minimum to ensure that they aren't mowed down with semi-automatics in school. I, it's I really disgusting that we're talking about, the, oh, this is very fashionable. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. I said, I was, I was clocking. I was like, okay, two minutes in, Maria Bartiromo is at least noting the utter yeah. absurdity of the situation it all needs for the fast pivot to looks cool but it's uh, going to be worth the five billion dollar industry in five years well yeah imagine if you're like an outfitter for one of these for like a S south american leader and you all of a sudden have the entire school population of america as a market that's a market baby it's who was the there was a it's gonna yes. bring bring down all that uh that stuff for the um for the leaders of the countries it's gonna be much cheaper for them because uh, it's going to be mass, mass That's produced. how markets work. Communists. That, the, who was, there was a guest that I had on a couple months ago who really, he choreographed this. Like, if you don't go, you need gun control, but if you don't go to, like, fundamental structural uh, policy, it will just generate new markets. Like, there you go. You know, he, he graphed it out. I, I still can't, personally, I can't get over the music. Yeah. I mean, that's it's, amazing. It's Maria in the morning.